Hello everyone, this is Balu. Welcome to my channel Silkif. In this video, I am going to discuss about latest placement statistics for the academic year that is 2022 to 23. That means this present year in which placements are going on. Okay, I have contacted my friends and I gathered information for you so that you can get some clarity regarding the placements of different branches in SVNIT and other colleges also. I gathered some information from other colleges also. This SVNIT I contacted my friends so that they can easily give and also I am giving my full time to gather this information. So please encourage me. Please subscribe my channel and also click on the bell icon so that you can get the time to time updates. So coming to the first plan that is SVNIT communication systems. You can see this is the internships offered in communication systems that is both you can see 38% of students and next Tata Motors it is 6% Xylem 6% Marvel Semiconductors it is 13% and similarly all other companies like NXP, Smart Associate Solutions and this is the average CTC offered that is average CTC 9 plus that is 9 lakhs per annum plus and also similarly Tata Motors it is 10 plus Marvel 20 plus NXP 20 plus this is the data that is I have collected this is on an average okay i am not telling the exact ctc but it is averagely it is above 9 plus, 9 plus and 10 plus similarly all these packages i have gathered okay this is about communication systems next coming to the vlsi this is about vlsi that is 2022 to 23 placements here you can see average ctc i am given synopsis nvidia marvel intel and coming to the packages here it is 23 plus lakhs per annum to 52 plus lakhs per annum, 35 plus lakhs per annum. And also you can see the percentage of placements it is almost equal like 29 to 28. Almost similar percentage of students are placed in all the companies. And also you have to know that initially the internship is offered by the various companies. After that internship, they will get the PPO directly after doing their work based on their performance. They will give the PPO like it is not guaranteed like they will definitely get the job in the after internship it depends on the person to person and company to company but basically most of the percentage of internships will be converted into directly placements okay this is thing what i have to say like because whichever data i have collected many of the students have like they are doing the internships only they have not converted that internship to directly placement like the companies are still have to give the decision on their performance so that's why whatever the data i have collected i am just telling you okay next coming to the this is the internships in vlsi that is for the juniors that is 2023 to 24 academic year okay you have, you have to understand i am collecting the junior students internships also you can see this is a famous company that is marvel intel seagate this is a companies which i have in which the students are doing internships currently that is on an average 35 to 50 K per month is the internship stipend. Next, coming to the this is the SVNIT environmental engineering placements for the academic year 2022 to 23. Among all the students, 72 percentage of placements is happened. Like students are placed in various companies. I included some people got government job also, and some people got like off campus jobs also. I include all those students and I have given this percentage that is 72 percentage of students are placed among the different companies companies here you can see the WSP, LNT, Emergy, Enviro this is a, one of the good company in which IIT Bombay signed in this company like startup by the IIT Bombay students and you can see the average CTC it is 6.5 in case of WSP, 6.25 in LNT, Emergy, Enviro it is 6.5 and Federal Bank this is a non-core placement like uh, 8 to 13 lakhs per annum is the average CTC. Next, Vedanta, it is 7.5 lakhs per annum. Next, TCS, it is 5 lakhs per annum. Next, TCS Ninja, this is an IT company. This is also like some students got in this. And 4.5 lakhs per annum is the average CTC. Next, Allen, you can see the percentage of students placed in each and every thing. This Vedanta, you can see 29 percentage of the students are placed. And you can see good package also, that is 7.5 lakhs per annum. You can pause the video and you can go through the placement statistics. Okay. Next, coming to the one of the famous and demanding branch that is CSC, Computer Science Engineering, for the academic year 2022 to 23. And you can see these are the companies which I have like visited. 
Marvel, C. Dot, Amazon, Bosch, NXP, NatWest, IBM, HCL, Aroha, and you can see the handsome packages here: 35 lakhs per annum, 44 lakhs per annum in case of Amazon. Okay, this is a very demanding branch. You know, like 100% students will be placed anyway at at the end of the college. That is just a simple thing you can see. But some in some years, like due to layoffs, it may be difficult to get the placements. But this is a placement statistics which I have gathered for this academic year. Very good placements you can see here. Next coming to the this is about water resource engineering. In water resource engineering, in case of HP and NIT, I am speaking. 60% of the students are placed in different companies, in which Dar Consultancy is a one of the company. Next Federal Bank, next non-core company. This is next Tata Consultancy Engineers. And coming to the packages, Dar Consultancy is offering average it is six lakhs per annum. Next TC is offering on an average it is 5.5 lakhs per annum. Okay. In water resource engineering, this is also one of the good placement percentage if I say among the, all the NITs. Next coming to the this is the NIT Durgapur. Like I I contacted the friends in NIT Durgapur. They said that 60 percentage of the students are placed in different com companies. In case of structural branch, that is structural engineering. In that among those 60 percentage placed students, LNT is a company in which students recruited. Next GR Infra, WSP. Okay, this is about the information about NIT Durgapur. Next coming to the VNIT Nagpur. Okay, this is uh, somewhat difficult to say because I contact with the students. They are telling that only 20 to 25 percentage of the placement is happened in case of VLSI design. Even I got shocked why this is happening. Because the thing what is happening in VNIT Nagpur is the college itself is not offering the internship to the students. Like they are not allowing the companies to take for internships. So that's why the placement is very low and the, many students are saying that they have to get the placement through off campus only. Okay, remember this because for example, if you don't know about the VNIT Nagpur and if you join and if you are not getting the off campus placement, then it is very difficult to survive. So please go through the whatever things this what I am saying. If you are okay with whatever the off campus placement, I can try and I can get the job through off campus also. Then you can join in VNIT Nagpur. Otherwise, okay, please keep it in mind. On campus placements are very less in case of VNIT Nagpur. Like I can't say for every year, like students from the previous year, like I contacted the students also, they are telling very less percentage of placement. This VNIT Nagpur instead focus on the academics itself. Like the subject knowledge, whichever you are going to get, it is very good and very like it will be helpful for you. With that subject knowledge, you can easily get the job. But the thing is, the companies itself are not coming to the VNIT Nagpur and the, they are not allowing for internships. That's why the placement percentage is very less. But you can, if you try in the off campus with that academic knowledge, you can definitely get the job. This is the thing which I have got from the various perspectives of the students. So thank you for watching this video. And I am still gathering the information from the various branches of the various institute. So please encourage me and please subscribe my channel and on the click on the bell icon so that you can get the time to time updates. And if you want any placement statistics of any branch from any institute, comment in the comment section of this video so that I can contact through different platforms like LinkedIn, YouTube. And I'm trying like many of the students are giving some placement statistics and few of them are refusing to give. So I will try my best to gather the information. Thank you.